Hey, what's shaking, Turkey Bacon? It's your host with the toast, Doc Mind Bender, and this is Doc's Rants. The baby, let's talk! Back on the chopping block again for like the fifth time. A video surfaced of this man backstage of his show, I believe in South Carolina, swinging on one of his very own artists named Wisdom. Wisdom is signed to his billion dollar baby label. Now there's some people saying that it was a security guard, some other people saying that it's Wisdom. It did look like Wisdom. And there's really not too much backstory as to what happened leading up to the fight, which really was only one haymaker from both of them. It seemed like they both connected. Um, first of all, shout out to the baby for always swinging on niggas bigger than him. I can almost respect that if he didn't do it so much. It feels like at this point, his compulsive violence has become toxic to the people in his workplace. You know, I have a lot of questions. Is the baby a menace to society? As a person in the public eye, this is like the eighth time we've heard of this man putting hands on people. Third time he done shot somebody. Nigga just shot somebody three days ago. Should the judge have sat his ass down? I think the baby definitely has some ego issues he gotta figure out. He's too free with his hands. He been busting guns on niggas left and right. I think he needs some inpatient treatment. Maybe some anger management. Or is this all WWE wrestling gimmicks to keep your name in the bloggers mouths? Cause it's working. You know, that's my first questions. My second group of questions, what would make a man swing on his artists? Was Wisdom pressing him about some money he was supposed to be paid on the front end or back end? My guess is it was money related. All these rappers bring their entourage on the road with them, opening up shows for them, and be having six to eight of their mans in the same suite, sleeping on cots, sleeping on hotel room floors, niggas not getting paid for their performances, just supposed to be grateful to be there. I'm not saying this is definitely what happened, but it sure looks like a moment of the show was over, the baby tried to slide out the back real quick backstage without being seen. Wisdom was all the way at the end of the hallway and was like, yo, can I get that little bit of bread you promised? I'm tired of waiting. The baby ego got scraped because he said it in front of everybody. He got in his feelings and he swung on him. That's what it looked like to me. I don't know. If you guys have more to the story, let me know. I bet you I'm in a ballpark of what really went down, though. Hey, be sure to subscribe. Tap that notification bell. Tap that like button. And don't forget to jump in the comments and let me know how you really feel about this whole ordeal. Till next time, I'm Doc Mindbender. Big, big, big.